Now a story from the obituary pages of the Telegraph. Now, I'm not familiar with Norman Lloyd, uh, the actor, but uh, Norman Lloyd, just to put this in some kind of context for you, Norman Lloyd was born November the 8th, 1914, okay? So he was born at the beginning of the First World, World War. War, okay? So he is Hollywood's uh, oldest working actor, was. He's just died at the age of 106. So in terms of when his career path, the trajectory of his career path, that means he was working in 1945, for example, before that as well, working with uh, Alfred Hitchcock. A uh, story here about how he was working in a 1942 film, The Saboteur, Hitchcock's films. Right at the end, he had to leap to his death from the platform of the Statue of Liberty. Didn't do it in reality. They built it another really? set, but he did ping over the side, do the whole thing. Uh, he was grey listed because they, there were suspicions over communists in Hollywood, so he couldn't work for years and years. Carried on working, and uh, right at the end, it says here, he credited remarkable longevity to an active lifestyle. Listen up, everyone. I'm listening. Active lifestyle, a daily shot of whiskey. I'm liking this man. And a 75-year marriage only ended upon the death of his wife, Peggy, which was oh. in 2011. So he's born in 2014. And, uh, you know, in amongst the many things he did over that time, played tennis, Charlie Chaplin. Played tennis with Charlie Chaplin. Mm. Ours is.